I'm Aditya and we are back at the chemistry labs. Today we will see an interesting reaction of copper sulfate with some metals. Copper sulfate is a deep blue crystalline salt of copper. It is used commonly as an agricultural pesticide. It dissolves in water to give a blue solution. The metals which we are going to react with copper sulfate are lithium obtained from Energizer Ultimate Lithium Batteries. It's an alkali metal, so it's quite reactive and astonished. Calcium, which is an alkaline earth metal. Aluminium, which is a post-transition metal obtained from aluminium foil. Zinc, obtained from battery casing, is a transition metal. Iron, and iron nail, is also a transition metal. Okay, let's see what happens when we add these metals to copper sulfate. First, let's take the transition and the post-transition metals. Iron. and aluminium. As you see, for all three, no immediate reaction occurs. The zinc has a few bubbles on its surface, but as of now, no reaction has occurred. Now this is a sample of these three metals left overnight. And this is a test solution of copper sulfate for comparison. First, let's take iron. The iron nail has been covered in a fine coating of copper metal. The solution also has a slight greenish tinge to it. The copper has been displaced from the copper sulfate solution and iron sulfate has been formed. Now let's take zinc. The solution has turned clear and the zinc has been covered in a black coating. This means the copper has been displaced from the solution and zinc sulphate has been formed. Now let's take aluminium. Aluminium also has a slight brownish coating which means copper has been displaced from the solution and a colorless solution of aluminium sulfate has formed. Now let's add the more reactive alkali and alkaline earth metals to copper sulfate and see what happens. First we take calcium, the calcium instantly reacts with the copper sulfate. But this time, instead of the copper metal, 
a bluish solid is coming out of the solution which means a different reaction has taken place The lithium also reacts instantly with the copper sulfate. Again, a pale blue color solid is forming, which means a reaction similar to that of calcium has occurred. What happened is the lithium and calcium instantly reacted with the water and formed lithium hydroxide and calcium hydroxide. The hydroxide ions reacted with the copper ions and formed copper hydroxide which is a pale blue solid. It is insoluble in water so it comes out a solution. As we see the solution color has changed. Pale blue solid is precipitating out. We have seen the interesting reaction of copper sulfate with metals. Thank you. I'll be back with more interesting experiments.